going on YouTube? It's a wonderful day today. Say hi y'all. Say hi. Say look, say hi. Hi. Come say hi. Say hi. Hi. Okay, that's good enough. It's a wonderful day today. Down here at my house. I got my new mount, my new camera. So uh hopefully I can get y'all some great footage today. Not today, but you know, when I get ready to leave, the truck is uh nice and safe right now. It won't be started up for a good two weeks, maybe even a week. Just finished up on my paperwork. I gotta stop smacking my lips. I know I, I know I'm pissing some people off. I'm uh I'ma stop doing it. Matter of fact, it's over with. You ain't even gotta worry about it no more. It's just a quick fix. Quick fix, that's all. Somebody somebody here to let me know in my comment section. No problem. Quick fix has already been solved. There's no need to worry. We have already solved the problem. You got something you wanna say? You looking like you got you got something you wanna say? Alright then. But anyways, me grab a seat right here to make sure it burns and tow this motherfucker up. You got something you want to say now? Hmm? Nothing you want to say. It's going to be a wonderful day this week. A wonderful week. I can't wait. I cannot wait. How should I hold y'all? should I hold y'all like this? How should I hold y'all like this? I don't know who all is going to the truck show. I know a lot of people want to go, but we got a lot of excuses. Trust me, I done heard all the excuses. I asked everybody here in my family who want to go, and uh, they got regular jobs. Their excuse was um, uh, uh, the boss said that they don't have enough vacation time. They got to continue shining shoes. That's what the boss told them. So they, they, they can't go, uh, I know, I, I used to, I used to, I, I had the same problem at FedEx. Glad them days are over, but they're not over for him. My brother been working at UPS for 15 years. I don't understand how he could continue uh, with, that, with that job. What, what are you over there doing? Eating grass, you need some food? Look at that. Dog gonna get sick. Go and get them some food from the stove. You hungry too? Sit back down for a second. Now we got plenty. We got plenty of uh the dope boys just got home. Neighborhood ain't changed not one bit. Anyways, I ain't even gonna put that on camera. Um, we're gonna be doing plenty of live streams. We got we got YouTube and we got Facebook. Now, I'm gonna tell you right now. I don't want any phone calls uh, about my live streams or about my videos. Um, uh, my hotels are not through my company. I don't, matter of fact, I'm not even telling y'all what hotel I'm staying at. They got through somebody because I'm not paying for a price. Somebody is. Somebody that, that uh, work at the Marriott. I already told y'all who it was. They paying for all my stuff. So uh, I ain't got nothing to worry about. They're not paying for it, but I'm getting it through a discount. The reason I keep moving around because I want to make sure... Then when I'm at the truck show, I can get y'all the best view possible. So I'm trying to get some practice in. Look at that, got to switch angles sometimes. You never know. I got to, you know what I'm saying, I got to practice a little bit. That's what I be doing. I be trying to double think, think about what I want to tell y'all next. But like I said, we're going to be doing plenty of live streams. We got Facebook. We got YouTube. Now, we're going to try to keep, where, where you at? See, you tried to trip me. You thought I, thought I went. 
thought I wasn't paying attention. We're going to be doing plenty of live streams. How many times have I said that? PG-13. That's YouTube. PG-13. For Facebook, though, Facebook may Facebook may be rated R or, or rated A. I, I don't really know what it's going to be rated. Let me get some 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 some, some shots with the with the sun over here. Can y'all believe I came home and they made me cut the grass? Look at this shit. Thought these damn days was over. I had to come home and cut some grass. Y'all know how how us new uh my generation is. I don't wanna cut no damn grass. We lazy. Ain't that right? Tell them my generation is lazy. That's what the older the older crowd be telling us. Those youngins. Y'all lazy. Y'all don't wanna do nothing. Y'all wanna get out there. Y'all don't wanna work. Y'all don't wanna shine no shoes. Y'all just wanna figure out how y'all can get rich and run six figure businesses and shine nobody's shoes. Come here, I'm trying to get some camera angles and you keep running away. Say hi. You, you never said hi the first time. Yeah, I gotta get some of them some of them angles. Was I talking about live streaming? But like I was saying, y'all gonna see a lot of a lot of a lot of stuff and I just need y'all to be prepared. Uh, I don't want any phone calls. Uh, we're not taking any drug tests. We uh, we don't represent any companies. My my YouTube channel belong to me now. It don't belong to y'all. Whoever y'all may be, I don't know who who all thinks that they uh on my YouTube channel. I want to make sure a lot of people here be skipping school. I know school is in, so you gotta watch these teenagers. They be out here trapping, is what, what we call it over here, trapping. School is supposed to, matter of fact, I think it's only noon. School is supposed to be in. Now this is my refrigerator I hid in my night truck. Not my refrigerator, but my cooler. That's about how big it was. That's what it looked like right there. I don't know what all this mulch is for. But that's about how big it was. I'm just rambling right now because I want to try to get a lot of different angles before I go to this truck show and I ain't got nothing that came to mind yet so feel free to click off the video because it ain't like I'm gonna say something something important ain't that right hey yeah say hi yeah I really want to leave today because I gotta go through Memphis yeah I gotta go through Memphis to get the to get to Dallas. Yeah, I gotta go through Memphis to go to Dallas. It's kinda sad when you see um people drug dealing in your own damn neighborhood. Nobody knows there's a hundred and fifty thousand dollar truck parked outside in the front. Most people don't even know how much 18 will it cost nowadays. They probably thought it cost 30 cent. They breaking a lot of houses over here. Uh, usually they breaking out those houses. If y'all don't know how my neighborhood is set up, it's kind of weird. So I'm going to explain it right quick. So back here, you got Section 8. You got Habitat Homes back there. Uh, it used to be nothing but forest back there. But uh, a couple of years ago, about three years ago, they tore down the forest, put up the habitat homes, and Section 8. Uh, most of them back here are just free homes. I believe you can get one if you was um, if you got like government assistance and if you uh, helped build the house, it was it was pretty much free. Or some of them people may be paying whatever they can afford. Then you got my street, which is just regular houses. These are your your one hundred thousand dollar two hundred thousand dollar homes um, the street over that those are gonna be your two hundred thousand three thousand dollar homes and at the very end of the street which is about it's about a two or three minute walk you got your your um, half a million dollar homes to a million dollar homes at the end of the street that I can't afford Matter of fact, 
I don't know, y'all can't see it. The trees ain't been cut. But uh, at the bottom, at the end of my street, we got, um, what's the lady name? Barbara Mandrell, if anybody know her. She was a famous country music singer. I don't know if she's still singing or not. She got her, I don't know how much the house costs, but she got her mansion down now. My high school used to do proms in the mansion. I don't even know if prom still exists nowadays. Wait, they done tore the damn school up. But anyways. I, I ain't never been to no truck show, so I don't know what to tell y'all about the truck show. I don't know. I don't know what to tell y'all. What the hell is that? Nothing moving around me. I don't know what to tell y'all about this truck show. You know, you got you got some information for us. Hmm. You don't know nothing either. Feel like I'm holding y'all up, ain't I? I'm holding y'all up. Cause I ain't doing nothing anyway. I ain't doing nothing but driving and 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 you got me playing on YouTube anyway. So might as well hold you up until I think of something. Today is Casanova's birthday, so y'all go wish him a happy birthday on Facebook. I already did. Forgot how old he was, but can't wait for the seminar either. I'm going to print my receipt because uh, after I paid, I don't know if I was supposed to print something out or not. i get it figured out. But back to the live stream, though. We're going to be doing live streams on YouTube and Facebook. I'm trying to tell y'all now. Uh, the live streams are not going to be as, as PG-13 as you, you may think. I really don't know what you're going to see. It's going to be pretty wild. I don't know what you're going to see. You Shit. Y'all just better get them alerts set up now. I don't know how y'all do them alerts on Facebook to where, uh, I mean, not Facebook, but YouTube or Facebook. I don't, some kind of way you, you go into your settings or you go to my channel, you press some kind of button and Anytime I do a live stream, it comes straight to your phone. I don't know how to do all that. But y'all can get that figured out if y'all want to get to that live stream. Matter of fact, uh, I got an 11-hour trip to Memphis, so I may do a live stream when I get to Memphis. We're going to be doing a lot of clubbing, I think. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. I don't really know what's down in Dallas. I done been through the interstate plenty of times, but I ain't never visited. Uh, looking at network, got to do some networking. A lot of y'all want to meet me, take some pictures. I need to take plenty of photos. Matter of fact, I think this might be my camera, my my, my photo camera thingy. Or maybe I might uh I might hire somebody else with me to take photos. Don't be afraid to ask for a photo. Just don't be asking for no autographs because I'm not famous at all. Yeah, I ain't even practiced no autograph signing. I may ask for an autograph from Cass, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but anyways, I thought the rain was going to clean my truck, y'all. I thought it was. Rain ain't did a damn thing. Speaking of the truck, about this maintenance fund, like I was telling the one guy, if one of these tires pop, man, you gonna have to pay for that tire. And and when you call Loves or whoever you call, it's gonna have to come out to you to change the tire. You gotta pay them too. Okay, you. you I mean, you need a maintenance fund to do these purchases. And me, um, I ain't had no problems with the truck yet. I'm not saying that you're gonna be as lucky as me. Um, I know it seems like everything I do, I done been lucky. But uh, you need a maintenance fund. Hopefully we go over there in the seminar. I don't know. Um, somebody else had asked me a question. One of the guys had got fired over here at Interstate. I think he was, uh, he was speeding. He wanted to know what company to see go to. It's a lot of companies you can go to. Interstate is not... Uh, not some type of golden company. You got quality carriers. That's about that's like three dollars a mile, but it's tankers. 
you can lease that truck on a quality truck you can go there we got um let me think try and give you the best opportunities quality carriers is number one if you want to turn your truck in I would suggest go in and, and, and if you want to go back company, you can go and do a car hauling. We got United Road, we got a uh, United States, I think it's uh, United States Auto Logistics, USAL, USAL is what they call it. Um, we got L. W. Miller, I believe. I don't know. I don't know what their requirements are for leasing on the truck. Now, if you want to get back on another low board. Uh, you got you got Celadon. You can go to Celadon. They got percentage. They got the same low board as us. Make sure it's percentage and make sure you're on the low board. They got the same low board as us. Most of their freight is East Coast, I believe. Um, you got Snyder, but you can't take this truck on. They got the low board. Most of their freight is East Coast. Not most. I'm talking about when I say most, I'm talking about the highest paying freight. So you got Snyder. You got Celadon. We got Interstate. Uh, we got a fourth company that also got a little board, but I forgot what they call it. I think it's like uh, Highway Interstate. No, I, I forgot what it's called, but Interstate ain't the only company that you can get this type of opportunity from. Uh, it, it's not. It's just y'all not y'all not doing enough research to find out. Now, I know a lot of y'all may have went to Celadon, and like I said, I'm talking percentage. I know I'm not talking about that per mile stuff okay per mile I can understand why you may have may not have liked Celadon I'm talking about percentage and low boy but I done ran out of talk I gotta go in here pack my bags do some paperwork get ready to pay Uncle Sam cause I got home and uh, Uncle Sam was up to his fourth notice with me I gotta register my business with the IRS he had sent his fourth notice and I don't know what the fifth notice is gonna be like uh, hopefully, we don't want to get no fifth notice. It may come from the sheriff. Look at that. They ain't got no food. Y'all finna eat? Hold on. It's okay. I'm heading in the house now. Can't wait. Can't wait at all. I'm finna learn how to make all kinds of money. Don't worry, now. If you can't come, don't worry. I, I got you covered. We, like I said, we're gonna be doing plenty of videos, plenty of live streams. You just make sure you're paying attention. We'll get back to you.